Welcome back to Birch Choir Commentaries of Punch Out. I'm Shang02 and I'm here with Dr. John Reborn. And welcome to World A of Title Defense Mode. This is where it starts to get interesting. Starting with Beast and Hondo, Hondo, this time suffering serious case of Wiley Lee I <laughs> I prowse. And this guy, he's fast. Uh, yeah. Also has one he hell of an appetite for eating that much of a sushi. God damn. Must uh, I? I don't know how, but like, he was able to run over three hundred kilometers, like at that speed. How is how has this like not been shattered? Oh God, he's entered the truck and ball sea territory. We're screwed. Uh, what I found out is whenever he does it, like his little twitch with his eyebrow, if you punch him and then block his counter thing, he you won't get a star that way. Uh, he'll immediately counter back, but then block his counter and punch him again in the head and you get a star. Okay. Uh, I, instant knock out is I think you just need one star, and when he does like his little face. Like when he goes from his one side to the other, you got a time right. When he's in the middle, one of when you just launch your star punch, he'll get instant knocked out. But I don't really do it in this part here. Yeah, I also recall that the instant knockout. The other instant knockout is of course. Oh no, no, wait, it's the same attack. Yeah, this. If you miss it, just. I actually don't necessarily know does it need to be a star punch. I think a normal punch, punch might actually be enough if you aim it at the torso. Yeah, uh, for some reason I was able to knock him out uh, once when doing it, but yeah, like it's, some, it, it's either random or it's scripted, or I'm not sure. Uh, I. I think it's scripted because once you get the timing down, you can actually do it multiple times, so I really don't think it's random. It's just that the time... Like the time they give you to do it is really strict. I think that's what it is. Mm. Ah, this is his fake. I think that you was the one. If you, if you actually managed to punch him into the torso during that one, that's an instant knockout. I think. Oh. Well, I punched him in the head. Yeah. yeah. I but, know um, I punched him in the head, but I think. They say defending the belt is I think harder it's than the it. torso. It's like awesome. the middle section punch that will knock him out instantly when he does that attack. I'm not sure, but that's how I recall it went. Hmm. And also, whenever he does his bow thing, if you don't see him glow yellow, he's gonna uh, immediately counter. It. Yeah. Yeah. And that bad bastard is back. I don't know whether this is stupid or really fucking badass. He has a goddamn bear as a coach. <laughs> well, let's see now. I can't start until I find my little. Uh, where? Oh, here am I. Here, where are you? Where are you? And once again, to prove that the regulations for this boxing association are complete shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. Bear Hunter, um. Well, that's the first obvious thing that changed. He has a little furry partner, and I just realized as soon as I said that that, that can be taken so wrong. I apologize. <laughs> but, uh, the point being that uh, he has his squirrel partner, and the other thing is that I think. The wind up for his attack is a little bit longer. Yeah. 
And yeah, pretty much it's just three star. Uh, it's a three star punch to knock him down. But you gotta have him stunned first to do it. Yeah. Yeah, this is where they start to uh, incorporate that that you need to uh, use star punch to knock the guy down. Which is gonna become real pain in the ass against a certain boxer in the next circuit. Hmm. Why conquer? I just saw Donkey Kong was a little bit more close to the ring just then. Oh, I missed that boss. That went by real fast. <laughs> I've been practicing. <laughs> okay, that explains so it because. Oh, yeah. I forgot. I because. You. <laughs> A little bit full of yourself there, Doc. Yeah, I'll give him credit. He does train Little Mac. Uh, have you actually, by the way, seen that, like. Uh, what was it? The, like the special thing in the club members got the what is it like a DLC for this game the Duck Lewis punch out oh yeah I, I saw the video of that uh, but yeah I think he it was only an exclusive to him take away his chocolate bar <laughs> <laughs> oh hell no <laughs> and this ass I remember you, you idiot son of a bitch. Oh, great. He's become the fucking avatar. We're fucked. <laughs> I wouldn't say so. Well, if you manage to somehow beat this guy without ever, without too much of a problem, good for you. For me, this guy gave me the biggest shit when I was playing this game the first time he died on the face. <laughs> I swear that this was like the first guy who got forced me to take like several practice rounds. Painful memories. But yeah, in case you couldn't guess already, his gimmick is that now the glow of his jewel is going to basically tell you what attack he's going to do. So it's pretty much a memorization game. Yeah. Oh. That's it! Oh. He also has this bullshit attack! Duck and release the power! And with that, ladies and gentlemen, we just punch a great time out of existence. Okay, I'm lost at words. <laughs> I mean, I know that trick, but for some reason... Well, then again, you said you did practice a lot, so... I guess that's gonna give it any of better restyling up, apparently. Oh, God damn it, Popinski, could you wait with your curses? We're just getting to you, you bastard. It's happening? And Mango going emo. Oh great. <laughs> Just don't start playing Linkin Park as your entrance music for fuck's sake. Not that I have anything against Linkin Park, it just it's too easy to jump to make. <laughs> Bit of anger issues, I see. Yeah. Also, I love this pretty wall. <laughs> I can help it. I just realized you edited it so <laughs> uh, And this is the infinity loop here. Huh? One, well, two, Michael, maybe you should three. have updated your tactics a little bit from all the way back from 
and he has this. He has oh, right he now he's kind of looking too easy. Oh, he, he, he is kind of updated. Like, I mean, you can't find him in the same place at in the same time. So, like, you can't do like three head punches in a row. You have to go like head, head, gut, head, head, gut. Mm, yeah, okay. But still, the fact that you can still get him into the infinity loop is kind of a downgrading factor. And one of the gimmicks you saw there was that the flamenco that that Delacrat punch he did in the normal mode is changed around a little bit. Now he can switch the sides from where it's coming from. Mm. Otherwise, he doesn't have too many new punches, actually. I think they're just a little bit faster now. Oh, dear. Of course, when the toupee comes up, that's when he gets real fast. As we test. <laughs> Yeah, once he, once he knocks it down, once he finally cools down. Almost. Not a natural one. Died? <laughs> yes, not a natural one. Dark oh, is a the puns <laughs> out. Fuck sake. Deja vu. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Nothing much to say here, folks. This is pretty much the perfect <laughs> right now. Basically, you can lock him into an infinity deal punches. That's a minute to sum it up. I'm not sure, but I think he does figure out how your pattern of punches works, or unless I was just being a bit too slow when I was punching him in the face. Um, oh, uh, I actually forgot he had that backhand punch. That's the one. He does that quite rarely, I have to admit. But, um, I think he, like, memorizes to block your, if you get him into the infinity loop, it's just that, once again, like with every other boxer in the title defense mode, that time scale for you to execute that is just very thin. Yeah. I think that's what it is. I don't think so. Don Flamenco. Uh, yeah, we know, smartass. Don't you know? With Flamingo, you got it, baby. The name's Bond. James Bond. <laughs> It's alright, Don, but you're going down. Shall you go down? Yeah, but he went down by his old exploit. Oh dear. <laughs> <laughs> no way these suckers gonna bring down the champ. Uh-uh. Are you ready for the next challenge? No. 
Yeah, I was just about to say no for two reasons. One, otherwise your battery is dying down, and two, because we have to go against certain bold bastard. And I don't think we are quite ready yet. <laughs> yep, damn. But that is the the major circuit. Hey, what would I? Now let's take down the next challenger. <laughs> work him, Mac. Work him. Hit it, kid. Hit it. Faster, faster. Come on, you can do it. Come on, Mac. Come on. Quick feet, Mac. Quick feet. Keep it up, Mac. Keep it up. And with that, that is part six of Punch Out for Birch Quiet Commentaries. I'm Shang02. And I'm Dr. Chan Reborn. And we will see you in the next part. Until then, see us later. See us.